This is disgusting, bro. This is America. Why is he doing this here? You can't be doing that in here, bro. Go to the mosque. You go to the mosque, bro. Nobody's standing up for you. Nah, nah, chill. Don't be doing that, bro. Don't be doing that. That's messed up. Go home. How about he go home? What you doing wearing that? Yo, hold on. I'm telling you right here, bro. What you doing wearing that, bro? Take that off. That's me. SQ. Using paid actors to harass a Muslim in public. Uh, why would you do such a thing? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Since October 7th, people's hidden Islamophobia has been rising to the surface, resulting in a 57% increase in hatred towards Muslims. So I came up with a diabolical idea. What if I ran a social experiment of a Muslim being publicly harassed and tested to see if strangers would defend a Muslim? Would they be courageous and stand up for justice to stop a Muslim from being bullied? Or would they allow a Muslim to be abused and humiliated publicly? Let's find out. Allah, Yo, look at this freaking guy. Yo, why are you doing this here, bro? Can you go back to your country, please? What is wrong with him, bro? Yo, you see this, man? It's a free country, everyone do what they want. It's a free, he wants to blow up the free country. I don't, I don't know, man. I don't. I'm not. I don't like that stuff, man. I'm not trying to get my country blown up. Yeah, bro. for real, bro. I like, like living, bro. Like, you know what I'm saying. I'm pretty sure Osama your cousin, bro. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> nah, for real, though, bro. Come on, now, bro. Uh, so you up? done now? Huh? You done now? Yeah, I'm going up the country. What's it to you? Like, come on. You can't do that here, bro. What's you up? Can't... What's the problem, bro? You can't do that here, bro. Are they bothering you? Well, what's the issue? What happened? You praying on our downfall, bro. You just like you trying to blow up the country, bro. You said you said I'm trying to blow up the country. Yeah, Why? Bro. By praying? Yeah, bro. By praying, I'm like, trying to blow up the country. Who even does that? Like, who does that, bro? Like, who who gets on the ground? Waalaikum salam. How are you, brother? Alhamdulillah. You hear what they're saying? They're saying I'm trying to blow up the country because I'm praying. Yeah, like you need to do that at home or like somewhere else, not not in a public place. Like, you know when you go to church and you pray at church and you pray at home. You don't just pray like anywhere, you know what I'm saying? Like you pray where you're at. So you don't just go out, you know what I'm saying? Do that. Wow. Yeah. Mother, you? Yeah. It's crazy the, the type of ignorance that would be over here, right? I think everyone should just be doing this where it's everybody's park. You pray. If you want to pray, you pray. Bro. Right, yeah. But what's what's the issue though? What's wrong because I'm praying? Because bro, you're not supposed to do that here, bro. Who says you're not supposed to do that? Does that make sense? What's wrong with it? Because that's that's the way how he practiced when he prayed. Like, bro, why here? Like, why, why not? Because like, why here? Like, but this is not, not this is not this is not a place to to pray. This where is place where. No, 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 no. Where does it say that? This exactly. Is not a Anyone place can pray where wherever they pray. want. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Uh, one thing I would just first and foremost like to say, thank you guys so much. We're actually starting a social experiment. This is a social experiment. Take a look at our camera right over there. Our second lens over there is over there. So thank you guys so much for supporting it. Assalamualaikum, <laughs> bro. Assalamualaikum. They're actually, they're actually Muslim. They're actually Muslims over here. How are you, my brother? They're actually Muslims over here. Alhamdulillah. We're Muslims, right? Alhamdulillah. Alhamdulillah. Sorry for doing that. We just wanted to showcase the Islamophobia that does take place and wanted to see who's willing to step up and say something. You get what I'm saying? And Meryl, Meryl was one of the first people over here yeah. to say something for us. Meryl, what was the reason, like, I noticed that you stood up for us and defended us. Well, of course, yeah. I mean, it's, uh, you know, freedom. Everyone has freedom. Yeah. Did, did, it did it bother you that they were speaking to me that way? Yeah, it bothered you? Yeah. It was uncomfortable. What about, you guys just stopped in the middle of, of what you guys were doing. And, and it, just, it bothered you so much. Yeah. Subhanallah, subhanallah, wow. That's amazing, guys. Thank you so much for keeping humanity alive because in Islam it says our job is to enjoin the good and forbid the evil. You understand what I'm saying? So any evil that we see, it's our job to forbid it. It doesn't matter what the religion is. It could have been someone who was Jewish, Christian, anything. Your job is to stop them and give them their rights because everyone has the right to pray and worship the Creator. Yeah? Guys, I appreciate you. you guys are so much fun. Thank you guys. Thank you so much. Thank you guys so much. Meryl, you're awesome. You're awesome. Thank you so much. Brother, may Allah bless you. May Allah bless you. <laughs> Thank you so much, brother. He got serious. He got serious. Meryl, quick question. Has anyone offered you a copy of the Quran before? No. No one's ever given you a Quran before. What are we doing? 
Meryl, this is a gift from us to you so you can learn more about Islam so that when any type of wrong happens like this, you're standing up for what you believe in and what you understand. SubhanAllah, the moment a Muslim was being harassed, these brave souls stepped in and showed courage. May Allah reward and guide them. But what happens when a Muslim is being bullied on a train? Let's find out. Yeah, nah, bro. Oh, they was really bugging last night, bro. Bro, southern bro. Nice, hey, yo, bro. This, yo, bro, what you doing, bro? Yo, what you doing, bro? Why are you reading that over here, bro? What's your problem? Reading that? What you talking about, bro? Yo, I'm just yo, reading. Don't do that on my train, all right? Don't do that on my train. Yeah, I'm just reading, bro. You awesome. Yo, I'm don't Muslim, do that. Yes. Don't do it. Nah, nah, nah. I don't like Muslims, bro. You like Muslims, bro? Yeah, I don't like. Look, he don't like you. He don't like you. Bro, I'm just. What you talking about? Yo, yo, don't read that, bro. Yo, put that away. Yo, put that away, bro. Yo, put that away. What you talking about, bro? We don't, we don't mess with him, bro. We don't, we don't mess with Muslims, bro. Nah, bro, he needs to get off the train. Nah, nah, nah he needs to get off the train, bro. What you talking about, bro? He can't be doing that, bro. He could go to the mo go to the mosque, bro. He could go to the mosque. Yo, he could go do his prayers in the mosque, bro. He can't do that in the in the. Yeah, he he got he got. Yeah, yeah, this is my train, bro. Yo, you can't be doing that in here, bro. Go to the mosque. I don't need to, bro. I can go read the on the train bro, over here. standing up for you. He don't clearly is. Bro, this no, the he's only not, bro. Dude, bro. So what? So what? All yeah, you need bro. is one strong. Yeah, what bro, you why you got this on you? Anti-Semitic, bro. It's not anti-Semitic, bro. It's anti-Semitic. What's up? How are you doing? My name's I'm Ronnie. good. How are you doing, Ronnie? Come sit next to my husband and Ah, he could do that in the mosque, bro. He could do that in the mosque. Alhamdulillah, these two heroes, without hesitation, stepped in to defend the honor of a Muslim. That takes guts. But what if a Muslim was praying near other Muslims? Surely he would have nothing to worry about, right? Oh, don't tell me you're gonna join this guy. Like, this is disgusting, bro. This is America. Why is he doing this here? Oh, all right, but I don't care what he's doing, bro. Like this, not here. Like. Like, these people are violent, bro. Like, why? Like, that doesn't make sense. Before you say these people, I don't know what you mean. The, the Arab people, these people be blowing stuff up. I don't know that. So you agree with this guy? Yeah, he's praying. You I, come? I don't think he's, I, I don't think he's a terrorist. I think he's a terrorist. You? Yeah, I think he's a terrorist. Well, let's ask him. All right, let's ask him. Let's ask him. Like, this is America, bro. This, this is disgusting, bro. I really, I don't get it, for real. I really don't get it. All right, but they don't, they don't pray here, bro. Like they don't pray, like. Are you one of them too? You do this too? Yes. Oh man. So. He's worshiping a deity. But they do ter they do violence. They do terrorism. But I'm not gonna then see your go your they they. Yes, they. People people that do this, they do this disgusting stuff, bro. Weeping generalization. Say that. Salam alaikum. If that if that's what you think, like oh, whoa, we have a whole thing here. Just act like that, guys. Oh. What happened? Like, bro, why are you doing this here, bro? This is called a prayer. Okay, and? It's a prayer. Go you ever pray heard of it? Where, go pray where, you, where okay. your people pray. Bro. So let me pray how I want to pray, and you pray how you want to pray. Uh, but you could go with your people and not do this What do you here mean, my front? people? These because, are my people right over here. Uh, well, they're my you people. and them could You're gonna go. You're going to say something? Say something not, to them. All right, they're not defending you, bro. They, they, they don't worried. need to defend not, me. Allah is defending They're not worried Allah's about defending you, bro. They, they're not worried about you, bro. Thank you. No, but like if you got something like over here, we can do something. You, you don't, don't, don't think I care, bro. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of you. Yo, listen to me. Don't be doing that, bro. Nah, nah, chill. Don't be doing that, bro. Don't be doing that. That's messed up. Wow. Wow. Nah, nah, chill. chill. SubhanAllah, these two Muslims abandoned me in my time of need. But Alhamdulillah, Allah's Rahmah came immediately. You see this? That's too serious. Yes. So why you did that? He's not supposed to do that here. 
Leave them, leave them, leave them. They're ignorant. They don't know it's anything freedom, about that. No? It's freedom. Don't, don't disrespect this. Do you know what this is? I don't care what that is, bro. Okay, if, if someone else do anything to her, his uh, religion, what about that? Jewish, anything. You see them, you see them do that right here? Why, why, why you didn't, why you didn't say? Anything about Jewish or... Oh, are they, are they doing yeah. Here? Good, good, good huh? point, if sister. Saw, if I saw yeah. anybody get on the ground... That would be anti-Semitic. No, no, no. That'd be anti-Semitic. Anyway, anyway, they do anything anyway. If no they one, did that to a Jewish no person, that would be anti-Semitic. No but no one wants to defend the Muslim. No. They see the Muslim over here, Islamophobic, and they're playing around with the stuff. Thank you. Thank you. Anyway. It is. Men now, women come. Jazakallah khat. We're not going to let these types of racist... Go ahead. You're gonna try to justify what you're No, because doing the here. truth is, I should be fighting him right now. I should be, but I'm not because that's how my religion <laughs> teaches. Yeah, you're not like that, bro. Don't even talk like that, bro. You're not like that. You're not like that. See, they don't understand. Like my religion doesn't teach me to just fight random ignorant people. It teaches me to say peace to them, salam upon them, because they're ignorant. When you're ignorant, the real fight is of education, yeah, yeah, yeah. of last of your ignorance. Tells you that's to the blow truth. People up, bro. Your, your religion tells people to blow people up, bro. Are you are you a Muslim? Yes. You're a Muslim, alhamdulillah. Look at this. I don't mean to put your hands on you, but you already said. Your religion tells people to blow people up. Say say that to my face. Your religion tells Say that to my face. Say that to my face right now. Say that right here to my face. Watch out, bro. No, my sister, we're just joking with you. Guys, clap it up for the guys. Clap it up for them, guys. This is this is this is our camera. Our camera is right over here. Our second camera is right over there. I wave to the camera, wave to the camera. <laughs> wave to the camera. No, Jazakallah Khan, may Allah reward no. you for defending us. For the record, come, come, come body slams May Allah reward you. you, come over here. May Allah reward you for that. Uh huh? You got him, man. You got him. You got him? Yeah, but hey, no one's, hey, but I saw, I saw, no one really stepped in. I saw, no one stepped in, though. I saw, no one stepped in. A lot of people were quiet. But hey, hey, but you know what? Let me, let me let me say something. Look at this, right? As a woman, as a woman, pay attention to this. As a woman, she came to defend, right? And there were men there who didn't do the same thing. This just shows you the courage of Iman. When Iman is in your heart, it doesn't matter. Woman, man, child, adult, doesn't matter. so bad. Uh huh. Thank you, my sister. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala reward you. Okay? May Allah reward you. Jazakallah khair for that. Jazakallah khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. Wow, the two Muslims completely abandoned him in his time of need. But subhanAllah, Allah then sent this courageous Muslim sister to stand up for justice. Showing you Iman and courage doesn't depend on gender. But you know what also requires courage? Building one of the largest masjids and da'wah centers in North America. Fully equipped with an accredited K-12 Islamic school, alim and hifs programs, and a community center for the Muslim Ummah to thrive in. Located in Atlanta, this project is going to be the hub for Muslims. But we need your help in purchasing this land. To avoid taking a riba based loan, we need $600,000 to be collected by October 22nd. If you were looking for a cause to invest in, a sadaqa jariya, or a place to give your zakat, look no further than the Najm Community Center. So click the link below or in the pinned comment and donate whatever you can and let's spread this deen together. So like I was telling him bro and like, yo, yo, yo. Yo, bro, you see this, bro? Yo, yo, bro, what you doing wearing that, bro? What you got going on, bro? What you doing wearing that? Yo, hold on, I'm talking to you right here, bro. What you doing wearing that, bro? What you doing wearing that, bro? Yo, why you got a dress on, bro? That's a nice, that's a cute dress, bro. It's a, it's a dog, That's a sorry. cute dress, bro. Nah, what are you talking about? Where you walking to, bro? Hold on. What are you talking to, bro? Yo, get off your phone, bro. Nah, 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 nah. hold on, bro. Where you keep moving to, bro? Yo, where you keep moving to, bro? Yo, take that off, bro. Yo. Yo, take that off, bro. Yo, it's not a dress, bro. Just take that off, bro. Yo, just leave me alone, bro. Oh, where you keep moving to, bro? Take that off. Yo, take that off. Take that off, bro. Take that off, bro. Yo, why you wearing that anti-Semitic stuff, bro? Yo, stop. There's nothing anti-Semitic about that, this. Bro? Relax. Take that nah, off, bro. Nah, bro. Just, just chill out. Yo, look, bro. Hey, Nobody mess with Muslims, bro. bro. Nobody mess with Muslims, bro. We don't mess with them, bro. We don't mess with them, bro. What you doing, bro? What you doing, bro? Just leave it alone. Yo, what you doing, bro? 
Yeah, bro. Yo, yo. Let's keep moving, bro. Forget nah, about bro. this bozo, bro. We out, bro. Forget about this bozo, bro. That's why nobody stood up for you, bro. Nobody stood up. That's why nobody stood up for you, bro. Mad soft, bro. Connection. Go back to your country, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, part of the interruption, which you guys just witnessed, of those of you who turned away, was an Islamophobic attack that was taking place. Since everything happening in Palestine, over 25% attacks have increased. Yet a lot of us stood quiet and silent, act like they didn't see it. We need to develop a little bit more courage to stand up for everyone who's being harassed. It's sad to see that people can see oppression and choose to remain silent. A train full of people, yet an Islamophobic hate crime was ignored. But the same couldn't be said about these two sisters who almost fought their oppressors. Look at this freaking guy right here. Are you okay? Did he bother you at all? Like, What is you doing, is bro? You? Sir, excuse me. Excuse me. Yo, bro, you're doing the most, bro. You're doing the most, actually. He wasn't gonna bother us. Can you? It's okay. Like, Stop going. Praying. Praying? That's how people pray now? Yeah. But they promote violence, I'm not gonna lie. Like, you don't remember what happened to our towers? Like, we had two, now it's only one. I, I can't I can't believe that y'all even defending this guy like I can't believe that she's still standing here. That's why I can't Well as long as he's standing there, I'm gonna be standing here. So like, what, what, what is this, bro? Him. Okay. Like, I don't like what is that though, bro? Like who who else are you she doing that? I'm just I'm asking a question. You asked if he was bothering us. No one's uh -huh. you're bothering us. Okay. So why are you still standing here? Because he's bothering me. He's bothering me. He's not even doing it. Okay. He is, he is doing something. He's doing something. nothing to you. He's doing nothing to you. You walked over here for what? Bro. You walked over here for what? Uh -huh. so you walked country, over bro. here for what? These people blew up our country, bro. You see, do, you okay. see, do you see the World Trade Center? They obviously don't know, bro. They obviously don't know, bro. They don't know, bro. They don't know, bro. They, they don't know. They don't know what they're talking about, bro. Yes, I'm gonna stay here. Oh, well, I don't care what you So we're gonna ask him a question when he's done. Exactly. Sorry about that, guys. Thank you. Can you stop bothering him now? Can you, can you move now? Don't apologize. Yeah. Don't ever apologize. No, because this is the type this of things that. People out here. I'm sorry about that. So you're yeah, good. We're, we're, we're ignorant. ignorant. You didn't. I, I hope you didn't. Uh, yes, you are. You no, 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 no. It's, I hope you not rush. No. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't rush anything like that. I really appreciate this. Thank you. Go home. Go home. I appreciate you. How about he go home? Exactly. <laughs> Can we get my towel? My towel. My towel. My towel. This is what the bullies do. Don't worry about that. It is actually. Thank you. No, no, you guys, thank you so much. Thank you. No, no, no. You timed in the right character. Thank you so much. No, no. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No, no, no. These actually, we're actually, they're all Muslims. Actually, they're actually all Muslims right now. Yeah, that's actually my cameraman right over there somewhere. He's right over there. Say hi to my cameraman right over there. Ladies, thank you so much. What what made you actually just speak up and defend me while I was praying? Because I heard you were very upset with them. What what made that? Oh, alhamdulillah, alhamdulillah, my sister. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, you you defending me makes sense. Are you Muslim? No, I'm not. Okay, so what what gave you that urge? Because she's my friend. Also. Alhamdulillah. And also, I just don't like ignorance. Uh huh. Like, uh -huh. Don't you, don't you, don't you. Uh huh. And also, I'm black, so you know, I go through. Subhanallah, subhanallah. Well, listen, in Islam. We're taught that we have to enjoin the good and forbid the evil. You forbade the evil. It doesn't matter whose religion it is. What you just showed right now is called the fitrah. The fitrah is the innate disposition that your creator has put inside of you. It is in our nature to defend each other. It doesn't matter if you're a Muslim, Jew, Christian, doesn't matter. If you see some wrong, the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said to stop it. He said, stop it, you see? And if you can't stop it, Go, go get some help to stop it. Go, go tell someone. Do something. Uh, but no, you came up. You came directly for the confrontation. You wanted the smoke. You wanted the smoke. I was a little scared. And the last thing he said, if you can't, if you can't stop it, if you can't get some help for it, the least you could do is hate it in your heart. And that is the lowest form of faith. Because unfortunately, a lot of people won't stand up. Some people walked away. You, you, we appreciate it. Some people actually walked away from us. Do you understand what I'm saying? So we really, really appreciate you guys. Let me ask you one final question. Has, maybe your friend has, maybe she hasn't. Has, have you given her or has someone given you a free copy of the Quran before? No. 
we're going to change that. Get, get, get out of the Quran. Get out of the Quran. We're going to change that right now. All right? We're going to change this right now for you, my sister, okay? We appreciate you wholeheartedly defending and supporting Thank you so much. everyone over here. We need more people like you who are here to defend the honor of not just Muslims, but any oppression taking place. So may the Almighty reward you and guide you and bless you, my sister. Thank you so much. Thank you, my sister, as well, for participating in the social experiment. These sisters wouldn't tolerate hate speech, not one bit, and got ready to throw it down when things got serious. But what happens when a Muslim is harassed, minding their own business in a public space? Yo, look at this fool right here. Yo, yo, what you doing, bro? Yo, yo, don't read that over here, bro. Don't read that. Yo, cut that out, bro. Not over here. Not What's over the problem? Here, yo, don't do that over here. Relax. I'm Not just reading here, my bro. book. Not over here. What you doing, bro? It's Go back to the mosque, bro. Go back to the mosque. Oh, yeah. Why are you wearing that, bro? Bro, stop. What are you doing? Bro. Stop. That's mad. Relax, relax, bro. relax. What's your problem? Yo, take that off, bro. Yo, take that off. Yo, take that take, off, take bro. That Just relax, off, please, please, please. Where are you please. going? He gotta go back to his country. What are you doing? Stop that. Please don't do that. Stop stop that. that. He has to go back. I'm sorry, stop that. He has to go back. Excuse me, what are you doing? Let's walk away from them. Nah, he needs to. Nah, nah, nah. What are you doing? Bro, yo, yo. Yo, go do that. Guys, clap it up. Clap it up. Thank you. Thank you so much, sister. Thank you so much. Allahu Akbar. This woman bravely stepped in between two oppressors to stand up and defend the honor of a Muslim. May Allah guide and reward her. But the next incident is far more interesting. A Muslim is praying and an innocent bystander immediately stands guard behind the praying Muslim in advance. Little does he know, his proactive action is about to be put to the test. Are you standing guard for this guy? Do you support this? Of course. He's a Muslim, he's just making the what is, what is he's that? He's praying. Praying. Well, yeah, he's praying he pray to like God. This. We're Muslim, we don't pray like this. Uh, I don't know, man. Send I think that's something you do in the, in the privacy know. of your home, bro. Well, it doesn't matter what you say. You have the right. I'm sorry. What's good? Huh? What's good? What's up? Nothing. I'm about to pray. Oh, you about to pay too? Yeah. You do this too? Yeah, you cool with that, that or not? Y'all do violence? Muslim. We're Muslim. We, yeah. I mean, are no. you not going to let me pray? You can do whatever you want. Okay, then let him do whatever he wants. Doesn't matter, man. Oh, if you can't pray, then you, you do violence? You my ass, bro, so that's going to make you the ass. I'll be, I don't can care. I, to, I don't care. I'm talking to God. You can do what you want, bro. Yo, what's your name? My name? Yeah. Eli. Eli, I'm Brandon. I'm good lordy. Brandon. That means you can underhook me. Boom, and I'm gone. You know that. I talk to God, the same God you do, bro. Okay. I'm praying for you. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Look at I, my color. Well, maybe you, we you the same color, bro. No, yeah, you're not the same color as him. So? So so how you try to relate to me? Because if I stay think? outside as long as he is, uh -huh. we're going to be the same color as him. But he's lighter than you. Then we got to stay inside because he's always under the, under the cover <laughs> working his <laughs> off those things. Those, those tent things, those carts, bro. With the disgusting food in it? Oh, that's delicious. Nah, bro, that's Yo, those are our people. Yo, we're all brown. We're all brown. We're all brown. What's happening here? What's good? What's happening? Good? Hey, yo, I appreciate that. You could pray. Appreciate that. Appreciate yo, that. Yo, respect, respect. Respect, bro. Respect. What's happening with you? Can do that in your, you can do that in your house, bro. You okay, bro? You okay? Thank you so much. I appreciate it. What's happening? Alhamdulillah. You're Muslim? Alhamdulillah. Oh. What do you mean? Can you leave that? No, he's not leaving. Yo, don't do that. Please bro, don't do bro, that. Bro, bro, bro. Don't do what, bro? Yeah, I don't even know. Do you do what, bro? I don't I fear Allah. I don't fear you, bro. Okay, bro. I'm just letting you know. Bad, you need dude. prayer. You need God in your life, bro. For you stopping someone like that, you need God in your life if you're being honest with you. I could point, I point, this is the Shahada finger. This is the finger that goes and points to God. Don't push my hand. Don't push my hand, bro. Don't push my hand. No, 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 hold on, hold on. They need to understand. If you're walking by, are you a pastor? No, but it don't, it don't matter. It doesn't, it don't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. So give me, the, give me your word then. It doesn't matter. No, teach me. Teach me, oh Messiah. Teach me. Since he can't pray to God, tell me what I should say. No, nah, bro. No, nah, but you're shut nah, now, nah, though, nah. right? Nah, you're talking to God, and you're nah, fing it up. Nah, outside, bro. 
Why is you doing that outside? Because this is all of hold God's on, land. Yeah. You can pray to God anywhere, Just anytime. Yo, no, 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 no. He's asking respect. Yeah, we do peace. Listen, hear me we out. Peace. Hear me. And look, maybe this is a teachable moment for them. It is. This is a teachable. Okay, listen, hear me, hear me out. The Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, said that no black is greater than a white. Or no white is greater than black. No Arab is greater than a non-Arab. In the sight of God, in the sight of Allah, which is God's name, everyone is equal. Do you understand? So you try to pull any try to card or something like that. I'm just trying to pray to my Lord. So I don't know what you guys are on. And if you guys don't like it, bro, I'm Jewish. He, he's Jewish. But he's praying, and I'm gonna make sure he can pray. So a Jewish guy is praying. Both y'all can beat uh, me up, and Muslim. you both know you can beat me up. But he's gonna pray because he talked to the same God. Jesus talked to the Jewish God. It's which the is God, the Muslim it's one God. God. It's, the same it's all God, one God. Bro. He's just talking it is to God. Allah. It is Allah. And God told His people to pray at certain times. But we're not judging none of that, bro. This is what Allah, God Almighty, this is our wanted moment. to do. But listen, I'm gonna just tell you right now. But I'm gonna tell you this right now. Bro, well, don't you guys need to. I'm gonna put my hand on you. Let you know. Listen, you need to watch out. You need to watch out. Watch out. Watch yourself. No, you watch yourself. Don't you ever touch a black man. No, on, he touched me first. No, no, come on. Uh, 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 uh. No, we, okay. we don't okay. want to do that. Like, okay, we're okay. We're not Yo, we don't teachable do moment. That. You better chill. All right, guys. Clap it up for the, clap it up for the, clap it up for the. Yeah. <laughs> this is a social experiment. This is a social experiment. You see my camera is right there. I have a camera right there. Oh I have a camera right over God. here. These are actually Muslims. These are Muslims. These are my brothers. These are my brothers. Yo, yo, yo. He's a young Muslim God. brother as well. Yo, I don't even know what it means. It means, it means God willing. It means it means God, God willing. willing. God willing. So inshallah. Yes. It means God willing. You see my brother? You see, we all come from Adam. Okay? Yep. Our job is to spread goodness and peace. This social experiment is to see who's going to stand up for the oppressed. You see, God Almighty says in the Quran, the last and final testament of mankind, that our job is to enjoin the good, forbid the evil. Anyone who saves one life is as if they save all of humanity. Exactly. You see? So we wanted to test to see who's going to be here to stand up. Are you people going to just walk away and let oppression happen? Or is someone going to stand behind me? And protect a Muslim while he prays. Y'all would have beat my <laughs> son. <laughs> I'm talking to the same God. Listen, Allah is the God of Jesus, the God of Moses, the God of Jacob, right? Wait, the God of, of Jesus, Abraham. Right? Oh, wait, of Jesus. Of course. Meaning, Jesus is a prophet. Yes, he's a messenger of God. He messaged God. Yes. You can't worship the postman no. for your tax return. Yes, you can. Yo, y'all better keep praying for me. We got you, bro. Thank Yo, you so I much. Love you so much. You're a lot of fun. Hey, Thank yo, you so much. Bro, Thank you for defending bro. the Muslim. Thank you, my brother. Thank you. Being brave or courageous has nothing to do with your gender, your age, or even how strong you might be. Rather, it's the condition of your heart that doesn't tolerate hate or bullying done to any innocent person. These heroes who risked it all on the line to defend a Muslim stood up for truth and justice. And for that, we thank them. And we ask Allah to bless and guide them. And if you enjoyed the social experiment and would like to see a part two being done, then get this video to 20,000 likes. And until next time, I'm out.